Three, two, one. 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 Welcome back to another episode of Cars Unlocked. Today we're giving you a POV test drive of the Nissan LEAF. We're gonna test out this electric car to show you what it's like so you can make an educated buying decision. All right, here we are on the interior here. Start her up with the push button start. All right, we're off like a pack of turtles, buddy. Now for 2024, they've made the LEAF as the S and the SV, there's only two packages now, so they're slowly streamlining these packages. And you can get up to 342 kilometers of range on this, 147 horsepower or 214 horsepower. Now, the things I love about these electric vehicles is the front end torque here. Now, I'm gonna show you when I hop on the highway, there is heavy amounts of acceleration. It takes off phenomenally, and it when you put your foot down, even in this small little hatchback where we're not trying to accelerate, they still get up and go very, very quickly. That's one of the positives about these electric vehicles. Let's try out the Nissan Pro Pilot Assist. This one has all the different safety features. It has the blind spot warning, the lane departure warning, the Pro Pilot Assist right on the wheel here. And I'm just gonna hit set. And now you can see it's locked into this lane and it's gonna almost take this turn for me. Not almost, it does take the turn for me. I barely have to keep my hands on the wheel. You hold it in one hand and drive with the other. Yeah. Interesting. I know, pretty mind-blowing stuff, isn't it? Now, you can see we have about 37% on our charge, and that's giving us about 97 kilometers. So, um, not quite the 342 kilometer range that they advertise, but you would think that you should get at least 300 kilometers on a single charge in this car. You can see here, I'm gonna deviate from the lane on my right hand side and there is the haptic feedback the wheel vibrated and notified me hey deviating from the lane now watch as I signal here with this truck right behind me and there it's telling me hey that trucks in my blind spot there and it's also telling me right on the dash that's what I love about the Nissan safety suite. Now for interior features, this one has a heated steering wheel, it has heated seats and heated rear seats, two USBs to charge, automatic temperature control, and you have the full Nissan Connect here with the map and the Navi. It's not as updated or cutting edge as you would see in some of the newer models, like Last week we were blessed driving the Audi. We'll link those electric vehicles in the description below. And obviously those had a lot more technology in them, but for a basic electric vehicle, this has everything you need. Nissan Connect, Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, GPS Nav, Bluetooth for your phone, Sirius Satellite Radio, and then you have the digital gauge here as well. I also got to talk about the shifter knob. I love this kind of ball-like shifter here where it's literally just a push up for reverse and a push down for drive. It really makes it easy when shifting through gears. Okay, so we're gonna try a little bit of a launch on the Leaf and see how fast it is. Like I said, 214 horsepower. And three, two, one, go. Slow on the takeoff. Boom, there's a hundred right there. Come back to bed, dearie. Not bad, I'm not sure how long that was, but. Oh. <laughs> 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 <It's a doozy. laughs> okay, so now I'm gonna activate the E-pedal here. And basically with the E-pedal, you can pretty much drive with one foot and you shouldn't really need to use the brake pedal because it will come to a complete stop for you. All you have to do is just let go of the throttle. It will slow down for you. So you can see here, we're in this little lot. And as I let off the gas pedal, it basically slows right down, so. I would say you would use this more in like city driving. I don't, on the highway, I don't really use it on the highway. Once you get used to it, it actually can help save the battery 
and give you just a longer range per charge. Check out on our Cars Unlocked flex meter to tell you if this car is a flex or a next. We're gonna link it in the description below. Keep an eye out for more videos. We will see you in the next one. Have a great day.